Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve if your webcam is not working properly on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu and type in settings. Best match, or come back with settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the left side, you want to select where it says privacy and security. And on the right side, underneath Windows permissions, you want to scroll down. And then underneath app permissions, select camera. And you want to make sure camera access is toggled to the on position, as well as for any applicable programs you may be trying to access the webcam with. So that's the first thing I recommend taking a look at. Next thing I want you guys to do would be to open up the search menu and search for device manager. Best result, should come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. You want to locate the camera's entry in here. If you're using an external camera, perhaps you may not see it in here, in which case select the view tab and then select show hidden devices. And then if you locate the cameras in here, you would double click on it, right click on your camera device and select update driver. Select browse my computer for drivers and then select my pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Go ahead and install the applicable driver if there's a manufacturer specific one. I recommend doing that over a generic driver. And then once that's done, close out of there and open up the search menu. Type in CMD. Best result, should come back with command prompt. Right click on it and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And then into this elevated command line window, you want to type in SFC followed by a space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit N on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run. Please be patient. So we're already running a scan, it appears at the moment. So you would have to restart your computer and then attempt to run this scan again. And in your case, you shouldn't have to run it again. You should just have to run it the first time here. And then once it's finished or concluded, you would want to restart your computer. And then hopefully at this point your issue has been resolved. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.